Today we're on a local commercial to test out some fishing tackle that I got from Wish. Let's see if we can catch some big carp on this bargain setup. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fishing Around. We're out at a local commercial venue today to see if this Wish Fishing Tackle unboxed in my last video actually catches anything. I know the venue, I've fished it several times before, there are some lovely carp in it and they put up a great fight on light tackle. Speaking of tackle, let's go over what I'll be using today. If you haven't seen my last video where I unbox and review this lot, go over to my channel and check it out. I'll leave a link in the description below. We're going to be using the Wish feeder rod and the small 1000 size Wish reel, which I've loaded with four pound line, and we're going to tie in a method feeder to start the session off and begin to build up this swim. Let's see how we get on. Okay, not a great start. That carp owes me a method feeder. I don't happen to have another method feeder with me today, so I'm going to replace it with a banjo feeder and see how that goes. The reason I'm using four pound main line down to a three pound hook length is simply because I couldn't get another spool of six pound mono in any of the local tackle shops or online. It's 2021 and at the moment we're still dealing with the COVID-19 pandemic shortages. I'm having to cast fairly light feeders as a result. It should be a good test of how smooth the drag on the wish reel is, if nothing else. Conditions today are all over the place. It's very warm, it's around 24 degrees Celsius, but it's also overcast and there are bouts of rain forecast this morning. So we'll see how the fish respond to that. Let's get into it. Where is it? Oh, Where is she? Oh, 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 you see that? It's a nice narrow look. Let's show it the net. Come on, girl. In you go. Get in that net. Oh, nice. Oh, First fish, and it's this lovely little mirror. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Mirror. 
and what a cracking fight he put up. All the wish gear seems to have behaved itself. The reel works, the drag is nice and smooth, and the rod tip bent round nicely. Nice action on the blank, actually. It didn't snap in half first cast, so that's a plus. Oh, we got to watch your rods in here, boys. Yeah, just let that give a little bit more eh? Someone has knocked that feeder, haven't they? Mr.
Another nice chunky little mirror, really testing out the drag on this wish reel. I can't fault the wish tackle actually, uh, hopefully the camera is picking up the lovely action of what is actually a pretty decent 20 pound travel rod. I think it's easy to forget that this rod breaks down into six sections. To me it has plenty of backbone, although I'm not exactly winching the fish in and I'm on three pound hook length so I'm taking my time with these carp. It might struggle to put pressure on slightly bigger fish, but we'll have to hook one to find out. If you are enjoying this video guys, please remember to like and subscribe, it really helps us out. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of the wish tackle. Oh, he knows he's hooked. Get the weed on. boys. That's a nice fish. Let's see if I can get him. Come here. He's in. He's in. He's just over six. What is that? Six, four, six pounds, four ounces. Lovely common carp. Bit of a better stamp than what we've been catching so far today. No issues at all playing him on this wish sour. Oh, lovely fish. Look at the scales on him. Ten ounces. Let's have a look at you, mate. Let's take your time.
<laughs> Let's have a look. Look at all that mud down there. I can feel him shaking his head. I don't know whether he's foul hooked. I think he's alright. See where you are, there's too much mud. Oh, in the net. It's a common guys, really nice fish. Well guys, there we go. A great day's fishing on a local commercial using a rod and reel bought from Wish and sent to me straight from China. I have to say, I'm really impressed. It did the job adequately and landed some nice fish. I may not reach for this Wish rod specifically over some of my other rods, but if it was all I had for the money, it's fantastic. Please remember to like and subscribe. And leave me a comment down below if you are thinking of buying fishing gear off Wish or if you've already got some and you want me to review it. I think I'll be testing out a few other Wish bits and pieces in the near future. I know that this company, Suga Yalang, make a travel carp rod that I might buy for a future video of people like this one.
Thanks for watching, guys. See you again.